basically you can choose the character you can toggle between the characters and then from that the character can pick an action so there's observe interact and move observe just watches the room i think and then interact you have to select a the screen so if i choose this then i'll get the axe yeah this is a project i joined for the otome jam this project was started by jen and she did everything here from the art to the animation to the code oh and jen is also a youtuber so you can check her channel in the description i joined the project as a programmer my role is to make the code more beautiful and that's what we're gonna do today so i think i already found a bug <laughs> you see here this is the score it's negative 19 um so we'll just filter it out so that it won't get to negative i actually don't know what will happen if it becomes negative so maybe they'll die or they have to rest so for the soul energy i think we found it so you can set the soul energy here and Hmm, I'm not really sure how you override code in rent uh in Python because usually in other languages just set and then underscore and again set plus value. But uh it's different here, so let's just take a quick search how you actually set the value in Python. So Python setter. So for the SE, if A is greater than zero, uh, is greater than or equal to zero, we want to set the age. I actually forgot to change the E, so there. Yeah, I think it should work correctly now. SE is not defined, SE setter. So to do this, we need this one and let's call this se and then let's call this stuff underscore se yeah it runs so now if we interact oh no <laughs> it crashed what did i do wrong this time uh infinite loop okay okay yeah it's because i changed this to se what am i doing <laughs> reload so okay so let's do this and then let's see the score yeah it won't change to zero but yeah there's still a bug so we really shouldn't be able to use this one if ever so let's just say zero hmm okay so that's one error fixed fix bug se becomes negative so let's try moving can't really move uh let's try interacting Oh, there's nothing happening. Oh, yeah. I think there's a bug there. I'm not sure. But there should be something happening when she interacts. Maybe it's a bug. Not sure. <laughs> okay. So let's just use um, Wreath for now. And let's interact. Select a spot of the room to interact with by clicking with the mouse. So let's just, uh, it's just, that's just an instruction. There seems to be something behind all these leaves. I think it's better if we remove the UI or I don't know, I'm not sure. This. Because like there's a lot more space if we remove it. So there, suddenly there's an axe and then let's click it. Joke, we have to press interact and then such a small and dull axe will have limited application. Let's click it. Acquired small and axe. And if we check the inventory, we have here small uh, blade. Okay, I do you even use this one? I don't know. So this is actually what Jen assigned to me. I've never seen this code, so I might hard have a hard time finding this. Okay, so Jen said that this was hard coded, but I see that she's using a pen so it doesn't seem like it i'm not sure let's just uh go ahead and um check this append item list where has this called append 
Oh, okay. So there are different items right now. Multiple items. <laughs> this comment though. Okay. So so we have a string here, uh array here, which is able to store different kind of objects such as item if we wanted to. So first let's check the item class. Yeah, there's an item class that has a name description and an image. And then it, there is an inventory which has items. It is an array. So what she used was append using an array. Okay, so first let's find how to use static class. Oh wait, can it be static because it has items? I'm not sure. Let's just store it. <clears throat> Best practices, boom. Okay, so let's just create an inventory. Inventory. Uh, I'm sorry, I forgot how the syntax is. Is it inventory plus new inventory? Oh my god, what language am I writing? I'll just copy. Yeah, it. I was doing it wrong. <laughs> so, yeah, let's set this to default. And then inventory, inventory. What is this object? What's this object? Shouldn't this, this be self? Ah, uh, it inherits from object, I think. I'm not sure. Yeah, I think so. This one is a class, so... Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I am so confused here. So, now that we have an inventory, it will initialize the, with an item. So, if we call inventory dot... I don't know. <laughs> if we call inventory here, so this percentage means that we're running a Python code instead of RenPy. So we can call here, here inventory dot, uh, was it, oops, was it add? Yeah, add inventory dot add. Oh, I forgot the item, gate key, the gate key. But first, we have to create an item. Let's just call it gate key. Oh, actually, let's start with the axe one because um, that's the first thing I found. I don't know where the others are hidden. So let's just go here and... Oh, 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 oh. I think I did it wrong. Yeah. Okay, so instead of doing this one, what we want to do is create an item which we can do by hand uh hand axe hand axe equals let's just say a <laughs> let's just say hand uh sorry sorry item hand axe and then say not really sure what this the description is i'll just copy it later and then last one is an image hum can i set it to none for now yeah let's just i don't know if this is doable or it should be i don't know okay so let's try running this first because we might run into an error and it might get complicated then 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 oh oh so let's get the axe and oh gateway active is not defined what I don't remember what action that rty I didn't change anything here what what okay so let's just check our resource tree for whatever reason it is missing a gate something what did I pull oh okay okay so let's just fix um the error and let's select wreath and interact with our item let's just delete it oh it's there mm. and now i have the axe and now it i don't know what happened <laughs> okay item list is not defined ah yeah because i remember removing it from the um 
source tree because I was so confused why I was running into bugs. Okay, so I think it's here. And I was supposed to... I'm not sure, wait. 972. Just go there and remove this and you don't need it anymore. So, you just reload this. And I should have my item. Of course, it will run into an error. What class is this one? So in item screen, okay, so instead of looping in the item list, we want to loop in inventory. And for item inventory item name and image button, I name function call item. What's this item? Inventory. What? <laughs> inventory. And then this item name should be this item name. So yeah, uh, let's just try running this, but it should work now. So much for work. <laughs> so let's just... Mm. Okay, so... Inventory is not... Yeah, because it's a... What am I doing with my life? <laughs> yeah, so inventory that I can... Let's try. Yeah, it worked. But it still uh, acts should appear here, but it's not showing because maybe because of this. I changed the name. Yeah. Because there's a developer tool here that if we enter what's happening? If we interact with the item um shift S, shift I, nope. Shift D. Okay. So there's a variable viewer and we have, uh, where is it? Okay, you can scroll. Is this sorted? Yeah, it's sorted. We have inventory, but I don't know how to open this one because it's not readable. Hmm. Console. Can this to print inventory? Print inventory. Yeah, it was I think there's nothing in it. Um is there something wrong with the code? Self items add I added this. Or did I? <laughs> Let's go to the hand apps again. Ah I fucked up, yeah. So what am I doing with my life again? <laughs> um let's say inventory and then let's say Add and let's add the hand app. Really April. Yeah, I'm a programmer and I I this is my normal. So now we have we don't have an item but we want to what enter okay, yeah. I don't know if that's a bug, maybe it is, it's mo it most likely is. So yeah, we have reached the item and it's here. We click it, it's a small I think this is hard coded, so let's fix that. Okay, so it's a small axe with a dull blade. Yeah, let's just search it. Yeah, there we have it. So, label hand axe. <laughs> it's funny that she has so many comments here. So, instead of doing this, we want to... I don't know if this is possible, but... Uh, label show description. Let's change this to show description. And then change this one to item. I'm not sure what the syntax is here. 